Here at the Beaverton, we aren't above cravenly hopping on the nostalgia bandwagon. And that's why the Globe and Mail has described us as the fuller house of Canadian basic cable. Uh, I don't think that was a compliment. And that brings us to this week's edition of Way Back Wednesday. Tonight, we take a trip back to 1994, the year Ace Ventura introduced us to the breakout star that went on to define the next decade of comedy, transphobia. <laughs> Whether it was Jim Carrey vomiting when Einhorn was Finkel, or Chandler using Kathleen Turner's portrayal of his dad as a gay panic punchline, transphobia was everywhere. In fact, transphobia was the most bankable star since racism's heartwarming performance in Ted Danson's blackface routine. <laughs> its career got so hot, it became part of the legendary Hollywood hack pack, alongside offensive accents, mocking the disabled, and Michael Richards. <laughs> but while transphobia's career may be on the downswing now that shows like Transparent have made it seem passe, it still continues to find steady character work with Seth MacFarlane. <laughs> Still, from hackneyed crying game references to Naked Gun sequels, where the least objectionable thing is O.J. Simpson, the mid-90s was the golden age of casual bigotry, and transphobia was its biggest star. The Beaverton, all-new episode Wednesday on Comedy.